Hey, it's Clay, and this will be a video chart on ticker symbol LLIT. We will take a look at the 30 minute time frame. If you're not sure what I mean by 30 minute, I do offer an explanation video at that link. So if you go there, I'll explain in detail. Very nice moving on this one today. I mean, when you stop and think that at one point the price was down here, and now it's all the way up here in just a matter of less than two days, any rational person would say, yeah, that, that's been a very nice move. But that does lead to the valid question now of, but is there any sort of true power behind this price movement? Is there any sort of genuine strength? Or is this just some sort of knee jerk reaction, dead cat bounce type move? I have no idea, but like I said, by using charts, we can make mapping out that question very straightforward. And in my mind, it all revolves around a single area, and that area is down here at the $2 mark. Why is $2 important? Well, hopefully we can agree on the logic that price movements with genuine power, with true strength, the price is gonna progress forward. The price is not gonna go back to where it was. So with that in mind, think about $2 mark. If the price were to come down to that area and then just continue on down, what would that be doing to the price? Well, from a very literal perspective, that would be putting the price quite literally right back to where it was inside of that range. And again, going back, not exactly a sign of true power. Whereas on the flip side of things, if the price were to come down here, but now all of a sudden behave in this manner before starting to work its way back upwards, now all of a sudden what would you have? Well, you'd have a set of lows right here. You'd have this set of lows down there. If you envision each of those as stair steps, well, now you have stair steps making progress in the upwards direction. And again, that's the name of the game. That's what a truly strong move is gonna do over time. It's gonna make progress forward. And in this situation, quote unquote progress, once again, being defined there as the $2 mark. As far as levels of resistance are concerned, the area that I'm very curious about going forward is this resistance tread line right here. So keep a close eye on that, and that'll be a, a good little kind of mile marker of whether or not the, this uh, momentum is gonna continue to build upon itself. But all in all, anyway, look at it. Fantastic volume today. Very nice increase, very nice bounce. Now it's just a question of can the price build upon this momentum? Let's see how it closes out the week on Friday. First off, thanks so much for watching the entire video. Real quick, before you go, I wanna invite you to a live webinar, web class, training, workshop, online event, whatever you wanna call it, but it will be me live revealing to you what I discovered that has allowed me to transform myself from being an employee to being my own boss, including how I had only one losing day out of 73 days in total. I'm going to cover three keys that have helped me unlock profitable consistency within the markets. The first key is super weird, but in a productive type of way. The second key is super awesome because it quite literally is wired into our DNA as humans, making it very easy to use. But in a cruel way, this becomes a pitfall for many traders. I'll explain it all though, including how to avoid the pitfall that it creates for some. And yeah, the third key, when you hear it, sounds way too good, way too, good to be true, but it's not, and I'll show you how it all works. Then at the end, I open it up for a question and answer session that is, again, totally live. Even if you can't make the live session, please still sign up as it will be recorded, and you can go back and watch the replay that I will send you. Click the image on the screen or click the link down in the description box so you can get the date and time and claim your spot, which I should note is limited due to the fact that this truly is a live event. If you have any questions, let me know. If not, I'll be seeing you soon.